Hi, Team Bird Box here and we'll be running through our app in full. This is the main page of our app and you can see a register, login and admin option. We are currently in the laptop view as we need to check the database. We will subsequently enter the phone view. First, let's try the login. As you can see, unregistered accounts will get a failure message. Currently, the database only has three accounts, test user, test user 1 and test user 2. Let's try to login using test user 1 or test user 2 as we enter the phone view. If login is successful, you can see your username at the top of the screen. We can now either select the AR option or the questions option. Let's look at the questions option first. This brings us to a common question forum where students can ask questions to their teachers. Anyone can then see the questions asked and this will remain even after they exit the app as it is fixed in the database. Going back to the menu screen, if one doesn't have an account, he can simply register using the register option. For demo purposes, we also have an admin option where we can log in offline. With that covered, using test user 1, let's dive into the augmented reality experience. The user will immediately be greeted with a pop-up instruction on how to use the AR. He can simply tap it to remove it. So we have quite a few features. When image target is detected, it will show the atom form and the appropriate buttons will show up in atom and actual form. When pressed, the model will toggle between atom and actual form. When two atoms are brought close together, there will be a series of possible though not exhaustive compounds showing up on the bottom left hand side. The user can press on the compound they want to see in either their molecule or actual form. When the model is being tapped on the screen, a description will show up on the side. We will now show the rest of atoms and compounds we created. We hope you enjoy the animations that we have made.